came across this image on a small time journalist's website this morning, and I couldn't help but chuckle because that guy in the skull mask and radiation goggles is me. Back in my extremist days, when I was in the Atomwaffen Division, a neo-Nazi, anti-civilization, revolutionary organization. I often get asked what the occult has to do with my putting on the mask and living the life of an extremist. And Insight Roll does provide an answer to those who are in the know. For those who are not in the know, there are a couple crucial concepts within the insight role practice that I feel non-satanic left-hand path practitioners could learn from and apply in their pursuit of wisdom. The first principle is antinomianism, which is the challenging of societal norms and moral conventions but not for the sake of a childlike rebellion. By confronting and breaking societal taboos, the practitioner aims to overcome socially conditioned fears, biases, and limitations. Antinomian experience also helps the practitioner see beyond dualities, transcending notions of supposed good and evil. Thus ultimately realizing the subjective nature of morality. The second principle is Gnosis, which is an emphasis on personal experience and direct knowledge. Unlike those in the right-hand path, whom emphasize faith and acceptance of external doctrine, the left-hand path practitioner should not accept knowledge passively. They should instead see knowledge as something to be sought after and personally experienced. Personal experience being understood as the one true way to obtain direct knowledge of a truth. These two concepts form the basis of the practice known as the insight role, which can accurately be called a form of antinomian gnosis. Pursuing direct experience of the forbidden to achieve personal transcendence and acquire knowledge. Generally speaking, antinomian gnosis suggests that the more taboo an experience is, the more wisdom there is to derive from it. With this in mind, I chose to participate in the most heinous and reviled extremist political organization there was for my insight role. Direct and dangerous experience of the truly forbidden, and therefore pure antinomian gnosis. My choice and experiences were extreme and dangerous. I would never advise anyone to join an extremist organization. There were many times I could have lost my life or endured retaliation against people and things I cared about. But even though I would never suggest someone else do what I did, for I can't know what's best for someone else, I wouldn't change a thing about my experience, even if I could. It was difficult, painful, and dangerous as all hell. But the wisdom and strength of character I developed from it, in the end, really did make it all worth it. Do with this knowledge what you will. I think antinomian gnosis is an extreme practice even in the left-hand path. However, we do live in an extreme world in extreme times. And if you want extreme results, extreme experience and extreme risk will be required. If you emerge from the other side of antinomian gnosis sane and in one piece, adepthood will certainly be within reach.